Hey guys, welcome back to some more Eel Tennis 2 and part 28 of our career mode. Today we start the Miami Open, our second Masters 1000 event. Who are we going to be playing in the first round? It could be anybody, remember, because we're not seeded. And we're playing Rampol and we're in the same uh, sort of quarter um, of the draw, same 32nd of the draw as Andy Murray. So that'll be interesting if we uh, end up playing him at some point. Uh, Roger Federer already cruising through in his match. But uh, yeah, looking forward to this. We're playing Rampol in the first round. He is a, a, a good player by the looks of it. Um, obviously we've upgraded our player since the last episode, added a lot of uh, skill points to our player. So we should notice a difference, but we were completely outclassed against Zverev last time out. So it would be nice to uh, put in a good performance today and, and, and hopefully uh, make it through to the next round. That is the plan anyway. If you're enjoying the series so far, make sure you keep hitting that like button down below so yeah need to continue to, to to get ranking points in these tournaments make our way up the rankings and uh, and you know that's the way we're gonna uh, improve our play at the end of the day is getting that prize money that's exactly what we want to do but here we go the miami open is about to start Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this first round men's match. Please make the players feel welcome as they walk out onto the court. Well, we get the option to receive first. I think that's a, a useful choice, just so we get a sight out of the ball here. But here we go. Just a little wide. Oh, lovely shot from Rampol there, and he's looks like a very unorthodox type of player. Oh, what a shot. That's what we're talking about, picking our spot. Just that little bit more power that we've got under our belt. And really helped there. Exactly what we wanted. So, 30 all here, and half a chance to make a positive start here. Oh, that's wide. That's disappointing. Because we sort of got the shot we wanted. Over the top. Good. Very good. Backhand down the line. Back at deuce. Ow. Just wide.
Well, how on earth that was called in, I'll never know, but it was. And he didn't challenge it, so... challenge that I don't think there was an issue with it and there certainly wasn't oh what an opening game that was close challenge in a row was just out. So there you go. Two challenges wasted there. Very important that we hold serve here. Got a foothold in this match. Missed. Struggling with a variation at the moment. Good. Yep. Almost made it over, but. shot and yeah we couldn't get it back what a return break point good very good once again good forehand into the corner and then off the top Frustrating the amount of unforced errors so far. Paul gets the early break and long I was sticking it out in these rallies but just got that unforced error at the end of it at the moment Oof. In some of them you know we you know, this has been a very easy hold for Rampol Disappointing. Well, three love. I'm just in trouble. So we need to Oh, 
I need to get a a hold in this. That's it. Annoyingly, it's replay the point point even though it was a clear winner and he's just hit a return winner, so definitely advantage him from that. Nice to overturn a decision once in a while. I missed. Oh, it's hit the line. Wow. Missed. <sighs> Just can't believe it. Can't believe that. We didn't win that opening point, even though we'd hit a clear winner. And now, um, three break points. This is all gone wrong. Don't think we've ever needed that. Last week more, I think we are just struggling with fatigue. And there you go, a break to love. And this is all gone wrong. we haven't won that point yet but amazingly we did in the end uh, we were throwing every, everything behind the return mm, lovely <laughs> giving them the thumbs up for that serve totally deserves it just struggling Movements are a big problem at the moment. Ow. Easy, easy peasy for Rampall at the moment. Ten unforced errors. Very few winners, which is unlike us. We're not hitting our Fantastic cross court forehands. And there's one. That's a brilliant backhand. So, let's start. From the back of the court, playing a fabulous drop shot. I think we need to come to the net more. Try and finish off these points. Oh. Did all right there. forward good so should hold on here best to much you can do about that I'm afraid. Once again just struggling with our first serve I'd be very interested to see our 
first serve percentage. And this set is inevitably over in a bit. I mean, once again, he's just hitting it so sweetly. Trying the old serve and drop volley, but uh, from 40 15, it's now set point. <laughs> That's a good serve. First ace of the match for us. Desperately needed that. Number two. Oh dear. Just not serving well. Oh, second serve ace. That's what we're talking about. Oh, it's wide. Couldn't quite. Get it back over the net and third set point now. Oh. There it is, first set to Rampal. Six love and it was a really disappointing set for us in the end. Nine winners, ten winners, serve percentage of 60. It's not good enough, really. Worth a try, I think. Just not feeling able to come forward as much as I necessarily like to. That was a bit of a shame. Eleventh unforced error of the match so far. He's just finding great depth on his shots, which is making us struggle. That's over the top and it hits the line. Well, very lucky there. 30 all now. Again, just out. It's worth trying because if we can get a break, it just help us get back into this match. Well, that's all right. Got it to juice.
Good. Very good. And this is the first time in a couple of episodes that we've had break point. Turn might have been a winner. No. Yes! Wow, what a break. And what a time to do it. You can see we didn't hit the best shot there. But got depth on it. And he couldn't keep it in. So we get our first game of the match. That's a break. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's a terrible, terrible start. Expect. Yeah, he's just starting to get back into this now. Three break points straight away. Ow. That's wide. Well, that was quick, quick and painful. <laughs> That's wide. Damn it. shot well you have to say well played to Ram Paul he's ramped up the intensity again but yeah I just think it's our stamina that's troubling us you know we've played week in and week out this year so far I think we're just really struggling to keep up fitness wise I think that's what did us against Verev that's what's doing us here. Because we're just not hitting the shots. You know, with any venom. That's terrible as well. I mean, our timing's completely off from what it was. Finally, win the point. I could have been curtains for the match there. Here he comes, and can we get ourselves 
our first hold. You bet we can, what a shot that was! He got it back and we didn't have time to get out of the way so it was a, a sort of cricket shot. We get our first hold. How can that reinvigorate us? That's the question. If we could break here, what a platform that would be. Oh. Good serve down the tee once again. So it's just too good. forehand that was but he just keeps getting them back and that's wide it's a pity so pressure's back on us here to serve and you know when we're being lobbed like that it's going to be very very tough Ooh, that felt like it hit the line. Oh, you are kidding me! Oh, no challenges remaining. That's wide as well. This could be curtains now. Three sloppy shots. So frustrating. You just cannot get that serve correct today. Oh! What a slice that was! I mean, look at this. You know, we hit the fairly pathetic shot back and he just poof, went for it. We were just taken aback, I think. There we go, 4 2. It's two games away from the next round. Oh, we managed to keep it in. Doing alright. Consolidates so, yeah, here, it's going to be very, very difficult to get back. Oh. Yeah, I'm just can't help it now. I mean, that was a brilliant point started off on the right foot we're just peppering the baseline with our returns sometimes they're missing it's 
sometimes I know. There's a couple of times. That's wide. So, 5 2. It's four points away. From knocking us out. And that's not really a way back for us. I don't think we've got the fitness levels or the form at the moment to get back into this. Wow. We perfectly timed that. Good. Well, here we go, tennis elbow. Just cannot believe how close some of these are. Too much points. I'm going to queue up our medical time out now. There we go. Match point. As long as we don't double fault, I'll be happy. Well, that's a good shot. One of our best of the match. 22nd winner. Good. I imagine if all that we needed all match was that medical timeout. Well, third match point now. Sharp down the line, and there you go, he wins it. And you have to say, he dominated in the end, and we really, really struggled. Overall, he was just by far the better player on the day, and I think we will sort of learn from that experience now not to go into these tournaments half baked. We need to, to have, you know, a, a very refreshed. Uh, body uh, going into these tournaments so that's the end of that one and yeah we just really didn't play well unfortunately but there you go excellent match played by Hannah despite loss apparently um, so there you go so definitely uh, need to uh, have a have a rest week now I think but there you go Zverev wins the tournament so well played to him beat Dominic team in the final which is uh, very very good we're up to 171 in the world we'll be having a, a couple of rest weeks just to get ourselves back on uh, course for the Monte Carlo Open we are down to 175 now but we'll be playing in the Monte Carlo Open in the next episode if you have enjoyed that Make sure you leave a like down below. It really does help me out. It means a lot to me as well. Subscribe to the channel for regular uh, AO Tennis content. And I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thanks for watching and goodbye.